I, lo I love that dried fruit. You have this? <laughs> Is that a Shem's candy? Have you had this? <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God, I had to... You ever have dried apricots? <laughs> Those are my fave. I love dried apricots, really delicious. I just discovered them. My girlfriend and I, we went two hours away. We were on a little road trip and she had a delicious bag. Dried apricots from Trader Joe's. You don't have that here. Anyway, <laughs> I'm driving. She's in the passenger. She's passing me the apricots. We are responsible people. <laughs> She's passing me the apricots as I'm driving. I had, what, 16, 20 apricots. <laughs> I don't know. They're delicious. I love them. But I, I don't know how they're made. I don't, know, I don't know how they do it, you know? So I was like driving and I picked up one of the dried apricots and I turned to my girlfriend and I was like, hey babe, like how is this made? Like it's like each dried apricot, is it like the dried mangoes? Like they slice up a mango, dry it and bag it? Or is each dried apricot, like is it a full apricot? Is each dried <laughs> apricot a full apricot? And she goes, yeah, each, each dried apricot is a full apricot. So I just had 16 fucking apricots? <laughs> In a single sitting? <laughs> I mean, even if you're on Weight Watchers, even if you're doing the points, I'm sure it's zero points, but it's a problem. <laughs> in the bathroom for four and a half hours. <laughs> Do we have any, any chefs or cooks here? Any chefs or cooks, thank God. <laughs> thank God. I'm gonna say something, a little bit of an unpopular opinion, a little bit controversial. Do you know what I mean? But I don't think making food is that hard? <laughs> We've only been doing it forever. <laughs> Besides fucking, it's really the only other thing we know how to do. <laughs> you are not a neuroscientist. You are not working on the depths of black Hoes, you make a food. <laughs> Yet there are 37 cooking shows. Everybody's sweating. <laughs> Racing the clock down to the last second to put a piece of parsley on a plate. <laughs> Just leave it for 20 minutes, it'll be fine. It's either 20 minutes or golden brown, that's it. So the two things, golden brown, 20 minutes. I can make food. I'm not saying I can make good food, but I can make it. I cannot do surgery. <laughs> if I do your surgery, you're dead. <laughs> but I can make food. Oh, foodies? I never met a foodie who wasn't the most boring nine to five loser living for the weekend that I ever saw. Have you seen these people? Foodies? I had a grown man, another 30 year old, have a conversation with me. A grown man have a conversation with me and he was talking to me and he self-proclaimed himself a foodie to me. Can you imagine the state of this man? <laughs> that he used this cutesy word to tell me he eats? <laughs> hey, you like food? So does the rest of the world. What an original over here. It's like somebody using a cutesy word like panties for underwear. Get the fuck out of here, you perv. 